Is this thing on? Hello? Mm -mm -mm. Hello? Hello, are you there? Are you there? Is this in 3D? This is supposed to be in 3D now. Look at that. We're coming right at you. Yes. So, uh, what's up? It's Jason Mraz. I'm here with our host today of the uh, Q&A. Wait, 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 wait a second. If I was hosting, I should, I should probably do that okay. part. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the show. Once, you know, I was really into when you were doing it. Why don't okay. you do it this time? You know? Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your host for today's Q&A. He puts the Q in Q&A. Give it up for Bushwala. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Back to you, Jason. Thank you, gentlemen. All right. So uh, I'd like to thank you for taking a break from your job at the used car lot to be yeah. with us today to talk yeah. to us. It's a good job, and some of us have to do it. I've been retired for like 20 plus years. So. I'm very aware of this yeah. because you've lived at my house for 20 yes. years. Thank you for aiding my retirement. No because if it, if it wasn't for you and all your successes, it would have work. Give it up for the Jason Mraz Foundation. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm glad I found it. Yeah. And in, in a nation of nations, you are the, are the all the nation coming together in celebration. I like that. Nation. In jubilation. In jubilation of, of, uh, of the constipation you had for the new album coming out, wow. your album, that has just been released. <laughs> Absolutely. So, smooth flow, steady flow of the new album, Love is a Four-Letter Word, by you. This is the same guy who, on the last album, brought you a um, island of reality in an ocean of diarrhea. Yeah, that was actually, uh, yeah, that was, yeah, that was me. Yeah. And thank you for capturing no, uh, my misery yeah. for your pleasure. That wasn't your made pleasure. up. That was, uh, that was real. That was partially real. It was mostly real. Yeah. It was three quarters. It was some real things. The words were real. I said, which was I really said. Uh, you really did. Yeah. So Jason, I'm I'm you know putting on a voice now to talk to you. I like that. Yes. Uh, and uh, at least I mean, if voice is good. You should have put some pants on to talk. To you. <laughs> I know. I know. Just glad you keep your hands on the. Okay. So we uh, we the world the audience the world that I was talking to earlier that I was on the phone with the world yeah. calls me from time to time. Okay. They were wondering um, something, uh, you know, all the pressure this week, tons of pressure. And all the pressure, it's a big week. It's made it be the biggest pressure week yeah. of a long time for you. So why don't you tell us about that pressure that's been building up? Yeah, well, that pressure, it really begins right here uh, behind the eyes. Right, you know, that's right. It's, it's, it's a sinus pressure. I mean, it's, it's allergy yeah. season. It is definitely And I've been blowing season. my nose all day long. Mm -hmm. I've, I've got, you know, scraps and scraps of the finest toilet paper in the men's room. This um, is this is made out of imitation ivory. Yes, that way no trees were uh, no trees or elephants were harmed in the making of this. Yeah, but uh, if if I could, yeah, you know, in I'd like to do a magic trick. I'd love to. I'd love okay. magic. You ready? I, I'd love it. Yeah. yeah, I'll look That's at the screen so I don't. Uh, ooh. Oh, ooh, I can feel it in my throat. I feel it in my stomach. Mmm. You like that? That's really good. That is really good. All right, you ready? Here's ready for the trick. Ew, let me see. Ew, oh, let's hold that, that up. Let's oh, hold that, that up. That came out of my nose. It's really good. That's nice. really good. That came out of his nose. That is mm. crazy. Tastes just like we were in the kindergarten again. Yeah. There are just a collection. Yeah. You know what I was thinking? What? That we could invent something. Okay. Moving on. I was actually thinking of like fourth grade pants. Like, yeah. right, you know how, like, if they pick their nose, like, everything like a fourth grader does, and, and like, you would have a place to put that once you oh pick your nose. Gosh. Like, when I finished fourth grade, this yeah. is no, actually, I finished third grade, going mm -hmm. into fourth grade, the kid in front of me, Chris Wells, and why is it when we're kids, when we think about our elementary school friends, we always remember them the first and last name. First names. and last Isn't names. that true? Yeah, Charles Barnett. Uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, so Chris, he leans over to me and says, hey. You want to see my booger trail? Whoa! And he flips his desk over, and he's got a whole year's worth of boogers <laughs> under his desk. And every time he picked his nose, he oh, God. to the emerald forest uh -huh. he had under his desk. That would, that would, do what, and then you, uh, did you feel small or like? I just you, wish I'd have thought of that. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, you felt small, like, dang. Yeah. I could I could have had him by three or four bugs. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's really great. I wonder if at the end of the year he kind of like made them all into one giant ball and played played around them. You know what I would have done? I would have taken my credit card and scraped them off them in a nerds and given them to somebody. <laughs> given them to that special someone that I'm not really interested in. Wow, all right, sweetheart. 
So uh, why don't we talk a little bit about the new album? The new album, which came out uh, two days ago. It came out this week. This week. It, it finally came out. Yeah. Um, and now it's in many, many players. Hopefully it's out yes. there yet. And hopefully it's out there serving a greater good. You know, it's definitely serving. As a songwriter, I, uh, you know, I love to write the songs, and then I love to just set them free in right. hopes that people cover them, hope they sing along, hope they use them in their weddings, hope they use them in their birthday, right. maybe use them in the hour of massage. Mm -hmm. you know, I think it's a great massage Karaoke? album. Karaoke. Now, a lot of you don't realize, but or maybe not known, but Bush Wall and I co-penned uh, uh, Curbside, Curbside Profit, Profit together. He's yeah. featured on Geek Pink. Geek Pink. Both of which. Uh, I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do, do anything. Right, right. right. Yeah, so both of which. Both of which. I was, at a, I was in Arizona, and I was at a uh, karaoke, and I got to sing a song that I wrote on. Curbside Profit, I got to do. And I really wasn't that great at it. I know. I should be better for having written it. Yeah. Some of it. Partially. So. so, album came out. We have a tour coming up, world everywhere. Woo! American tour coming up at some point. Yeah. Um, I'm doing my little immunity dance here because mm -hmm. I can't afford to have sinus pressure. Right. Not, you know, the, the tickets are on sale. The dates mm -hmm. are all posted. And so I am, I'm going to show up. And I'm going to be healthy and present. And I'm going to rock. As you always you. do. I'm going to yeah. knock your socks off. Knock your rocks off. I'm going to light rock I'm your gonna face be, out. I'm going to light your socks on fire and I watch you dance. Adult contemporary, well, your tuchus. Yeah, you're going to get yeah. inside out. Yeah, you're going to be inside out, baby. Entrails will be on your feet. That's right. So what I love about that, <clears throat> what I love about that is that you at home can help aid in your sinus healing. Because if all these people that are checking in now and all these people that checked in earlier put positive thoughts and positive vibes. Oh, my gosh. Tractor beams right at this dude right here. Yeah. I won't even – I'll deflect them off of you. They bounce off of my hand into your face, and then and then the healing just happens like that. So do that at home right now. Yeah. We're going to take questions from you in a second once we show you this uh, tap dance number that we've uh, been working out. Here he goes. Here he goes. Tap dance at your price. Take a J. Take a J. It's kind of like a. There it is. 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 Course line. Course line. Course line. Course line. Da 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 da. That was good. All right. Great. Now we should probably move on to questions. Strictly come dancing. Okay. Now. If uh, please make your questions in a statement form. Wow. We actually lost viewers during the tap dance. I noticed we, we were did? up to about. Uh, I think we were up to about 10, 13, and then it dropped to a it dropped sad one. 10, 11. It's 12, 10, 12. It's you bad. Ooh, one. we're losing them. We're losing them. Um, all right. Oh, wow, they're really going away. Okay. No, they're coming back. No, they're going away. I think this is interesting. I think By the end of it, you know, we should just read The Great Gatsby like they did. In, um, all right, in, Let, um, let's actually read something here. Okay, okay. we're going to go to a video feature in a, in a few minutes, and we'd like to remind you to please wear headphones. Mm. Right. And Put your or do not have volume too loud on your video chat. Otherwise, it's going to create feedback. Unless that feedback is intended to be a healing blessing, which will clear up my sinuses and make me um, the opportunity to sing like a bird tomorrow. Um, so everyone get your headphones on and get your volumes adjusted. And the album is on iTunes, don't forget. The so album just is definitely on go iTunes. Go to iTunes. That's J-A... Send Marads at on iTunes and, and you just pick that album right up. Yeah. So uh, here we go. We got a question. Um, uh, we're gonna go through a lot of statements, which is really great. And um, um, in in Chile, thank you, Chile, here for being go. there. Um, yeah. Chile is excited for you. What it's, it's okay. Warmer, which wow, is ironic. those qu those questions are flying by. Hang flying. on, let's freeze those questions. Okay. Hey. How I saw how no, it's like did a lot. Of Crazy. Ha ha. How did can't wait to come homo. Okay, here we go. <laughs> um, last book you read by Julki. Uh, I read Shantaram. Oh, which, was a, which is an epic. It took me most of uh, the promo tour to read. Mm -hmm. um, but it was quite a, an awesome, awesome journey. True story of a guy who broke out of prison, went on to help many people in India. Yeah. Very cool. Ram. Shantaram. Um, you know, I'd like to add something about our tour that's coming up, too, which is something we've never done before, which I'm very, 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 very excited about. Um, all around the world, we're going to be uh, organizing saplings and new trees to be planting mm. 
in just about every city that we're going to be touring to. Because shortly after I came back from Antarctica, in fact, while I was flight home from Antarctica, I uh, I was incredibly confronted by how much we consume and how much I fly and how much my flying contributes to the carbon emissions, mm -hmm. the greenhouse gas emissions, which contribute to global warming. Right. So I felt yet again that I am personally responsible for this. So we started a program using um, uh, forest departments and local charities and schools, communities that have organic gardens, and we're going to be planting trees all over the world. So uh, looking very much forward to that. And then, of course, every year that we tour, we can add trees to these right. forests, or we can go back and have a little snack or yeah. play some music under the very trees that we plant. That's amazing. And for any inspiration that you get in your life, you can plant a tree with this idea in mind, too. Absolutely. You know, take it under your wing. We just had two more trees planted at the uh, house. We certainly did. Or the hurricane. So I saw one. Uh, I did see a question. Uh, I saw love your hair, and I'm really grateful for that. I, I love your hair. I too. love your hair. Oh, you inspire you. my oh, hair because yeah. I was cutting my hair. Uh, yeah, you were. You and I always cut. Yours was longer. Yeah. Um, and what's that about? You know, I get a lot of slack from all departments on the hair. What's up with yeah. that? Yeah. Well, uh, about a year and a half ago, I was incredibly bummed out. Can't tell you exactly why. It's just I was I was living inside a shadow of something's wrong. It happens. And. Uh, you know, I was just about ready to quit on all things, ready to retire, ready to just not really care, you know. And then it dawned on me, wait a minute, before you quit, before you even consider going down an even darker path, you know what I mean, uh, why not go out and do some radical shit? Yes. Why not give up your car, give up your house, why don't you go and, and move to a different city, why don't you start riding a bicycle everywhere, grow your hair out, surf bigger waves. Um, you know, live at your edge because you know if if something should happen along the way, big deal. You gave up months ago anyway. You had already right. hit rock bottom. So for me, growing my hair out was sort of an extension of that moment where I said, you know what, I'm not going to give up. Right. You know, I've I've tried growing my hair out ever since I was in high school, and you get to that awkward stage. I mean, it's probably in the awkward stage right now. And you always cut it. You go down to Fantastic Sam's and you say, cut it all off and dye it orange, please. Right. And you know what? Life is an awkward stage, and so we're always trying to just grow ourselves out and live the life you want to live. Absolutely. Live don't, any, don't let anybody tell you what to do or how you should look or that you should need to change your underwear every day. Whatever. Whatever. You know. Okay. All right. Um, let's see here. Um, all right. What was your inspiration for 93 Million Miles? Mm -hmm. Well, Bush Wall is into horticulture, and he grows a very special kind of plant in the backyard, and that definitely took uh, 93 million, million, million miles. Ooh. And back again. No, no, come on. Um, oh, this is A, says someone. All right. And you know what? Thank you, because <laughs> I'm an advocate for equality, and when someone can openly speak out on this forum that says this is gay, then, uh, then I appreciate you coming out. And, and I, I'm very much excited for you and your family who's watching today. Um, I wish I could pick up whose name that was, but congratulations on being gay. And, um, you know, I think it's honestly one of the bravest things you can do is truly be yourself. Yeah. And if you if you have that inside of you and you feel like coming out, I mean, do, do so. It. Just like growing your hair. Just like... Because it's a long way to, to it, happiness sometimes. Yeah, you exactly. Know. All right, so we have about 15 minutes left in this here chat. I like this one. The, the, this 12, is, the 1130 yeah. one was a bit chaotic. Yeah, there was more people in the room. And it was, it, and, and, yeah, that was okay. You know, that was good. I like it. Shortly this after the nice 1130, stuff. I developed this incredible sinus pressure, and I got crazy body aches. And actually, for the last five hours, I've been sitting in a dark room, tossing yeah. and turning. True. This praying, is true. Pray to God that uh, it isn't terminal. It's not. No. If you swiveled your, swi you, you, you swiveled your hips, you could use it as like turn signals. 
Yeah. Yeah. I could hang a dish rag on it. Um, so what oh, favorite song on the album? Really? Hey, look, Morass Wallet. That's funny. How come shoes on the show last night? You know, I wear shoes sometimes when the stages are um, a little a little wonky. And every now and then you stage that, you know, it's it's temporarily built in the parking lot and so there's cracks in it and there's debris backstage and, and I didn't have a carpet on the stage where I usually stand, so I I've been feeling more comfortable to uh, just wear my shoes. Yeah. Plus the boots I wear have like a thousand thousand laces that you gotta do up and that's just a drag taking yeah. them off all the time. But I promise you I'm not wearing pants right now. Yes. Yes. Just 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 uh tops. Your tops. And I'm bottoms. Well, yeah. <laughs> Moving on. What is the difference between uh, recording we sing and, and love? love? Like between the two albums, what's the difference between recording? Um, that was by Michael May. Um, well, I recorded We Sing in uh, London, and it was more of a collection of songs. I was working on a variety of songs, and a lot of the songs came from a song game that yeah. you and I played. Well, good. Right. We would make up a song each week, and after about 80 songs, I had enough that I made an album. Well, uh, the Love album really was more about a concept. You know, it began with, uh, began with these shapes right here, and, uh, and when I saw the shapes, I said, you know, I can choose to see love in that image, but it's just shapes cleverly designed. And, and so ever since I saw that image, I thought, I really want to make an album about love. Not because I'm a master at love by any means, but because that's what was coming up for me in life was to learn more about it. How can I be love in the world? How can I choose to see love in the mirror or in others or in the world around me? And it really is a choice that we make. It's, it's a perspective. I feel honestly that life is an inside job in how you think, how you speak, Right. How you act and what you're attituding in the world um, makes up your life experience. So you can choose to be love or you can choose to be miserable. So those are the biggest differences. This album actually had a direction that I wanted to go, and many songs that I wrote didn't make the album because they didn't fall into that category right. of love that I was uh, going to do here. Right. So we are going to switch, switch to, to the, the video. video. This is exciting. All right. We are going to now ask you to click on Start Broadcasting. Wow. Yes, and please. All right. And while we're waiting for that, the, the question Nancy Adani asked, what did the blue stripe in your face mean? It means we're having a great time. Denise. Oh, Denise oh, came and went. went. Hi, and Denise is back. Hi, Denise. What's up, darling? You're looking super cute tonight, having a little online chat. Denise, there might be a little delay. She looks like she's using a dial-up modem. Uh oh, oh whoa, my whoa, gosh, hey. we got Sheila wow. on the line and Michelle. This has okay. never happened in my life. Oh, let's, let's start with Sheila. Sheila, okay, oh, let's start with Michelle. Michelle, what's your question? What's up? How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Where are you? I'm in Canada, in oh, Toronto. Oh, right. Canada, eh? What's all the fuss um, about? I was wondering how many avocados you eat in a day. Oh, wow. <laughs> Maybe hundreds. Yeah. Maybe one. <laughs> I'm sitting on a few right now, like eggs, mm. actually. One of them he actually lays avocados. I do. Wow, like, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Um, at least one, at least one a day. About half go yeah. in my smoothie, the other half show up in my salad later on. And um, believe me, I'm getting pretty sick of them. Really? They're amazing, though. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They're pretty amazing. Okay. Yeah, Can't wait to see you in Toronto. Happy. Oh, very cool. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, Michelle, we'll see you there, and I'll have a few avocados for you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right, oh, Hi, Jen. Oh, hey, up? Jen. Is this a blockbuster night, Jen? What are you doing at home? Oh, your volume's down. Can you turn your mic on? Okay, she's mm -hmm. here with her man uh, oh. who didn't believe that she would end up on the web. And he's like, yeah. God damn it, look at her. She's on the web. I'm going to talk to him. I'm going to talk I to him. I thought that was crazy, but look at her. Who's the guy she's talking yeah. to? Look at you now, Jen. Oh, oh Jen. Yeah, that was great. Well, you guys have a great night on the couch. Yeah, Natasha, Natasha Cohen, what's hey, up? Natasha. You are the grand prize yes, winner. Sir. You're doing it. Um, Natasha, so I'm going to send you this. Oh, my God. Um, so Go can ahead. I just say that like, I'm in yeah. love with the song, Silent Love Song? 
Oh, cool. Uh, and like, I'm a vegan. I'm I'm a vegetarian. I just want to know about your veganism. Great. <laughs> well, uh, you know, actually, it started because Billy and I we decided we would start cooking for ourselves. Yes. And I have no idea how to cook meat, and I didn't want to get worms or mm -hmm. a mad cow or anything like that. Your roommate's mm -hmm. uh, coming. Check it up. Yeah. She's totally. That's stoked. actually my twin sister. Sister. Yeah. She's my twin brother. We look similar. So anyway, we we found that eating vegan and vegetarian uh, was a lot easier. You know, you just kind of put all the natural ingredients together. Um, can you guys wrestle for us? Yeah, <laughs> go for it. Go for it. Do it. Just start throwing down. In the name of vegan. Come yeah. on, do what vegans do best. Yes, nice. And remember... Oh, oh, that is some hot vegan on vegan action right there. Yeah. And remember, yeah. eat your whole green leafy whole food diet. Absolutely. Oh, my God. I'm seeing you in at Jones Beach in September. Oh. Jones Beach is amazing. That's going to be the best show of the tour. But don't tell anybody else in the other cities. Awesome. Well, it was nice to talk to you and, and your beautiful you. sister as well. I like your bamboo. Thank you. Okay, let's go to somebody else. <laughs> All, All right, right. Nikki, Nikki, 83. Hey. What's up? How you doing? I like your backdrop that you put up there for us. She's coming to us from the Victorian era. <laughs> so, what's it like in the days of yore? Where are you, where are you, where are you reaching out to us from? Oh, oh no, you don't have sound. You don't have sound. Uh, maybe you can mime it. Two words. Okay, she's saying uh, Saskatchewan. Ooh, she said nah. Saskatchewan. That was one word. Okay, is a good is a place. Okay, let's go to somebody else. Ba, 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 da, ba, mm -hmm. Here he comes. Oh. Kayla Baraka. Kayla's decided to go with the dark room. Yes, I like that. What's up, Kayla? Side lit. Kayla is clearly in a place where it's still daytime. I like that. Maybe she's on the west coast. Kayla, is that true? Thumbs up if you're on the west coast. Hawaii. Uh, I can't hear you. Uh, oh, shark, shart. Sharts. Shart. Holy shart. Okay. Oh, here I lie. Make sure, hey, everybody, make sure your microphones are on, because if yeah. we go to you... Uh, I want to hear you. Yeah, microphones on, shirts off. Yeah. That... <laughs> okay, here we go. Somebody else? Here. And we have Lindy Sucks. Uh, what's up, oh Lindy? Hi. How you doing, oh guys? You good? What are you, where, 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 where are you coming from right now? Where are you at? New York. Lauren! I'm uh, talking to Jason. Lauren, get your ass in here right now. Oh, oh, Lindsay. What is it? What's up, Lauren? Oh, wow. My God. Forever. Oh, my God. I'm going to cry. I'm going to close people ever. Oh, my God. I'm going to cry. Do you guys have a... Question, comment, concern, or fear? Um, <laughs> I didn't even think. You never can I. Nothing. We're going to your show in Jones Beach. Oh, I love that. Right. We were just speaking to someone so, else from Jones Beach. Jones so, uh, Beach. I promise you it's going to be the best show of the tour. Yeah, yeah. definitely will. That night. <laughs> will be the best show that night. Yeah, of the tour that night. Your last Probably. show was amazing. We went to it. And your other show before that at, where were we? So Carnegie Hall. Yeah. Uh, Carnegie yeah. Hall was a blast. I'm glad yeah. you guys were there for that. That was I got a little tear at first when I walked out. I thought, this is my <laughs> moment. Oh. Yeah. Maybe we'll see you later and I'll see you at Jones Beach, okay? Love you so much. <laughs> oh my god, hi. That was nice. That was really nice. They were excited. Should have got their number. I could have. Yeah. <laughs> Jennifer. Hey. What's up, darling? Uh oh, we got no sound. Sound. Jennifer, can you hear? Oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. She got to adjust the mic. Uh-oh. She has a look of distraught. She's, you can she's, do it. You can do it. Pull yes, up. yes. Maybe pull your headphones bit. out and see if the audio kicks back on. About that. Okay. Uh, I it. feel like I could teleport myself into that, in that room that she's yeah. in right there. Check the carburetor. That'd be amazing. Can't hear I, you. Jennifer. Jennifer. Mm. Oh. Okay. Sorry, Jen. Okay. Well, if uh, you guys should have a pen and paper ready, so in case the sound doesn't work, you uh, can just write and hold up your question. Catherine Class. How do you do, darling? Oh. Oh. Good. 
She's looking very peaceful tonight. She is looking peaceful. Is that your leg in your lap, or are you holding a cat or a pillow? A blanket? Ah, a snuggie. A snuggie. Yeah. I like that. I bought my mom a snuggie. Is it movie night there at home, Catherine? Or is it book yeah. night? Or is it screen night? You know, all those can be one night. They too. can. I cry myself to sleep with ice cream mm -hmm. all the time. Christine Kachat. She's, wow, is she Come on, Bone. You're the next contestant. You, you just gave us a great Price is Right face. You right did. There. Your hair's great. You do exactly what I yeah. do. The camera comes on. You're like, oh, my gosh, my mm -hmm. hair is all fat. What I am I going to do? Christine, we can't hear you, unfortunately. We have a sound issue, so we're going to move on. But you're looking great. Audrey Winters. Hey, Audrey. I can hear you. Oh. Come back. And she there has you Audrey are. Hepburn. And you have Audrey Hepburn in the background. It's a sea of Audrey's. I like that. You know, I also love Audrey, uh, what was it, Audrey? From <coughs> Audrey. 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 It was just Audrey, yeah. yeah. I love that. Where are, you, where are you at, Audrey? Can you hear me? Are you in a sauna? It's like a sauna. Yeah, I think that was a steam room. You know, whenever I'm in a sort. sauna, I like to go in there and go, it's like a sauna in here. Um... Elephant. What's up, Elephant? That's a great name. It's like Beautiful Elephant. Oh, she wrote. And she has Can, can I, I Sing, sing with, with You? Yeah, but unfortunately, you don't have any volume. Um, you but, could uh, mime together. Yeah, but uh, you look like a great singer because these days, singing's really all about how good you look. It pretty much is. Um, but what city are you in? Uh, quick, write it down. Here she goes quick. This is like Pictionary. I'm going to say Toledo. I'm going to go Philadelphia. Toledo. 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 She's in uh, uh, Rochester, Rochester, New York. New York. Was, home of the garbage plate. And the uh, and, and, and cars. All right. So we will be up in the New York area. And, uh, and uh, make sure you come sneaking around and sneak in the building. And we'll see if we can sing together. Okay? Thank you, Bella. All right, Bella. All right, we got time for one or two more. Hannah White has got the dope headphones. Yeah, yeah. She's yeah. mixing up the ones and twos every, right every, now. Every, 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 every. Your name is Hannah. Hannah yeah. White. Hannah White, I got the white walls. Hey, hey. Ooh, hey. Man, we can hear you. Talk to us. Oh, perfect. Okay. Do you like cats or dogs better? Well, I'm a cat person myself, but we also have taken in the dog. We have taken in a dog. A big old Old, old, I say old. Very dog. old. This dog is old. It's like a hundred. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> and I prefer cats. Um, uh, ferrets are super cute. We had a ferret one. We did have a ferret for a yeah. minute. I used to bring home all sorts of animals. Yeah, crazy exotic uh, pets. Scorpion. Snakes. Snakes. Yeah. You. And you. All right. Like we had a goat. What about you? Are you cats or dogs? Have you ever eaten cats? Oh, uh, cats. Yes. yes. <laughs> I just admitted that. Yeah. Did you like Cats the Musical? I was 10, so I think that makes sense. I never saw it. Yeah. Sheltered Life. Yeah. yeah. Well, you have windows in that white walled room of yours that you're there in? Yeah, oh. I'm in Stevens Point, Wisconsin. Oh, right, Wisconsin. Wisconsin. You guys got great creameries up there. <laughs> good, good custard. Good custard shops. Come but on, don't tell my second. vegan friends that. Yeah. Don't put a spoon in me. All right, Hannah. Well, we're going well, to get... I just bought tickets to see you guys in Minneapolis on September, so super stoked. <laughs> It'll be the third time now, so... Oh, very cool. Well, it's going to be all new songs. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to shave my beard and just have a hollow notes mustache. <laughs> uh, Perfect. You're going to see my new rainbow unitard that I'm going to start wearing on the tour every remember, day. You remember Slim Good Body? You remember Slim Good Body from old PBS television? He had, she's, uh, you might be a little young for that. It's just like all his organs and blood <laughs> and bones. You, you remember that? Oh, okay. <laughs> all right. Yeah, well, everybody. that's kind of the theme for the tour. Yeah. Sounds good. So hopefully you get your money's worth. Okay. Slim. Is oh, it's okay, guys. Awesome to talk to you. Sam Perkins. There's a few awkward moments when doing this too, like when they, when it's supposed to go in. Hey, here we go. Katie like Miller. Yeah. Oh. 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 Can you can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, we got you. Oh my. All right, Jason. Can you say happy birthday? birthday.
What? Who's Sing happy birthday. Is? My birthday is tomorrow, 420. Oh, right. Oh, and okay. I just got out of the hospital yesterday, so. Oh, right. Oh, my gosh. For <laughs> good reasons or bad? Were you Food poisoning. Were you in the hospital? Oh, okay. Food poisoning. That's a, that's oh, my a God. This is awesome. No way. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. Singing a happy birthday song that was downloaded in my ceremony. Yeah. And it goes like this. Happy birthday to you. You who you who happy birthday we love you. Yes, oh my god, do. I'm like about to cry. Happy birthday, it's your heyday. Hooray day. <laughs> happy day we celebrate. Oh, happy birthday, we cherish you and relish you, admire you each and every day are inspired by you. Happy birthday. <laughs> oh my god. Happy birthday. Oh, that's for a picture, man. Thank you. you. Happy birthday. We're not finished. We're not done with the song yet. <laughs> Happy birthday. We love you. <laughs> All right, Katie, we're going to do you our birthday handshake. Okay? okay, ready? You got to pay All attention. Right. You only get to do it once. Okay. Okay, this is your okay. birthday handshake. And if you and your friend can start to do this on 420, which will be uber appropriate. Amazing. Okay. <laughs> hey, what's up? What's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, yeah. All right, you got it. Got it. Okay, now, yeah, you got, got it. it. Hey, you guys do it. Okay, hold on. I don't even know what he did. Uh huh. All right, what's up? Yeah. Is that close? Oh, okay. Oh, that was good. The hand, the hand <laughs> touching. That was like an abbreviated version, but I'll give you that. We should have time. All right. That's That's great. Thanks. Happy birthday, Katie. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And happy birthday to everyone out there who's celebrating a birthday in 2012. Yeah. I think we should have a, a joint birthday party for people who have 2012 birthdays. Birthday. Marissa. How are you, darling? I'm seeing you in a long time. No. Yeah. I saw you last night. Were you oh. at Kimmel or were you watching television? I hear you. I was at Kimmel. All right. All right. What'd you think of my Willie Nelson awesome. pigtails? A lot of people hated those. <laughs> I loved it. It was great. The band was cool. great. Mm. Make sure you call my manager, my mom, and my label and let them know I loved my pigtails. I will. So, uh, <laughs> do you like the new songs? I do. But I was I, I love all the songs, but I really liked um, What Our Love Looks Like. Oh, I know, so and that didn't make it on the album. Yeah, yeah that but that just, means, album, so. that just huh? means it's yet to come on another delicious album. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, hopefully you'll perform yeah. it in uh, at the Hollywood Bowl or in San Diego. Okay. Okay, I'll, <laughs> I'll definitely consider that. That's one of my favorite tunes, and thanks for mentioning that. It's good to see you. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah we, we've, known Marissa, we've known Marissa from way back. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> she's, uh, helped, she's helped out in local shows and... San Diego, and has always been a long-time loyal fan. And thank you for being one of the 1,100 people on this insane chat today. It's going off. I'm glad really I finally good, made it through. Yeah. My new jacket. This is a premiere of my new jacket. Love Are it. you wearing good. pants? We're matching colors. Anybody's? <laughs> yeah. Huh. I don't think anybody's had pants on the whole show. No, no one. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll see you soon. I'll try to play. Uh, this is what our love looks like, either at the bowl or in San Diego. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this is that moment I was yeah, talking about. Yeah, this is that awkward moment where we just, uh, uh, just yeah. hang Woo. out. All right. Um, well, we're, I think we're going to have to start wrapping it up. Yeah. Because I have a crazy sinus infection, and I'm going to go take um, a good amount of Theraflu. Yeah. I could sit ease, here for two hours with my ease my trainers. body aches and, soon too hard. and take a bath and you, some Epsom salts. Yeah. Well, you and, got it. Uh, you got all the things. You rest up. I'll and be up. You love uh, yourself. I'll be up at 4:45 tomorrow morning doing radio on the East Coast. So if you if you're around the East Coast in one of the major cities, you can listen in. I'll probably be on your radio station. If you haven't picked up the album yet, uh, I'm, which I'm sure you have, because all you guys on this uh, on this chat are amazo, and uh, maybe call your cousin, uncle, brother, sister, maybe gift them one, uh, because at the moment Lionel Richie is selling the hell out of his record. And I would love to sell a lot too, Lionel Richie. Yeah. Remember, iTunes, pick it up on iTunes. New album's out. 
New tour coming. We're all proud of you, buddy. Oh, I'm man, happy. thank Thanks you so much. You me. know, I honestly live in gratitude. I, I quit my last job in November of 1998 and uh, set out to pursue music. And since then, I have been doing that through the coffee shops, the open mics, through the small clubs, through colleges and living room concerts. Um, and, you know, obviously 10 years of touring and, and people in cities welcoming us back and believing in the in the message that's in the music. And... Uh, and I, and I have living gratitude for that because I know so many musicians who don't get the chance to uh, to be heard by everyone and uh, who don't get a chance to uh, get all the face time that I get. And, yeah. and also, it was through the generosity of others when I first started out that gave me a rich quality of life that really got me going um, and kept me fed. And they would take me to dinner and take me to the movies. And I love being in a position now where I get to do that for others. Like, enrich people's lives and, and give to found uh, give to charities and, and help with the projects and be outspoken for this, that, and the other. And uh, it really is a cool gig. So I thank you for making that possible. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Bushwalla.net. Uh, yes. Jason Morales, very grateful to be here. Wait, <laughs> how do we stop? Print.